And I'm instantly transformed. Before I made these three videos, just past 10 minutes now, maybe 15 minutes, I was feeling very tight, very uptight, very edgy, very irritable, not very friendly with the people around me, and doing my best not to blame my external surroundings for the way I was feeling, but just closed off, bottled up, don't want anyone to anything, blah blah blah, sucking at life, basically. To summarize, just being a general, I don't know, it's pretty common and normal, but it's not really very, it's not optimal, that's for sure. And when you're a blah 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 blah, but the point is, I made a video just before about using my voice and my well, liking my voice, the sound of it, and that's probably the main reason, is because when you express through your voice, you're unleashing energy that is trapped within. And when you do something like press record on a camera and make a video and express, 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 it's like setting free all of these beasts that are inside you clawing to get out without making a target, without causing damage, without causing harm, without... Sometimes it can be too late. Like my angstiness and irritability has probably already caused some damage and harm for which I will have to... I don't want to say compensate, but compensate, balance out, you know what I mean, just be more present and more compassionate and more conscious with my newfound relaxed state. So using your voice is a tremendously important tool for well-being and health. I would encourage anyone who's watching this to play with their own voice for at least five, ten minutes every day. Just find some time in the day, maybe when you wake up in the morning just go and stand on your balcony if you've got one or go and stand in the garden if you've got one or go and sit on the toilet if you've got one stand in the shower, the bathroom is a great place to do this because it often has crazy echo and makes wow wow sounds and you can make awesome, sounds like you're at a concert and it's just you and do it, play with your voice because it will make you feel better it will make you feel amazing, it will make you feel alive, it will invigorate your body beginning here and here and then bouncing everywhere and coming back to you and it's just a holistic beautiful wonderful loving d delicious process and I really want you to share in that because something I've enjoyed I want to share it with you and if you've never thought of that before then now you've got the idea run with it go jump in the shower and sing your guts out peace 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 where is the peace peace is within someone awesome said in the video Violence has to acquiesce to peace. Peace is not about being super passive and allowing people to be the way that they are and not ever trying to blah blah blah. Peace is about maintaining peace through enforcing peace. And it's not about enforcing peace like peacekeepers going around with guns saying, hey, be peaceful. It's about emanating and exuding non-violence and peacefulness. And I'm doing this face here because I recall in my own being not doing that. I exude frustration and blah, 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 blah. But nonviolence must acquiesce to peace. People killing and maiming must acquiesce to those who wish to end killing and maiming. Or, I don't know, oh, fuck. Such a difficult world we live in, so complicated. If you've got any comments, anything to suggest, anything to say, 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 say it down below. And as always, 